Hey you guys, it's Sunshine Vibes with the High Vibrations. If you are new to my channel, thank you for watching. If you are returning, thank you for subscribing to your girl. Love and light to you all. I hope everybody is doing good. So this is going to be my last reading for today. My earth signs. The first card that came out was Virgo. So Virgo could be very significant, but this is for my earth signs. Okay, so I'm going to tap in. Let's see what we have for you guys today. Archangel Michael, give me clear messages for my earth signs. Ooh, we have faith. Have faith in your dreams and confidence is the key. New moon in Leo. So you all are being called to just stand up, okay? Stand for something to fall for anything. I'm always saying this, but this is something you always have to walk by, okay? You have to um, stand on business. Somebody's really standing on business at her. Whoever you are, you can be business oriented or this is where you're being guided to be, okay? You're, guiding to, you're being guided to be successful and confident, Confidence is the key. Ooh, whoever you are, yeah, you a real stand-up kind of guy, okay? I could be talking to a divine masculine, but you are real stand-up-ish, okay? Spirits like, okay, suit and tie. Some of y'all could be getting in the, okay, what's it? Getting in the flow um, for something so much greater. Like, you don't even know. You could be just like, I'm picturing somebody just like trying on different suits. So you could be, okay, about to go somewhere where you need to dress up, okay? There is something you are doing, but you are putting on your suit and tie, whoever you are. Ooh, wait, yes. Yes, you are. Okay, baby. <laughs> Indecision. I use my intuition in all aspects and relationships. I am attracted to those people who serve my higher good. So, yeah, your intuition is going off. Like, you know that, you know, you are attracting somebody that is for your highest good. And you're changing something, huh? Yeah, and you're persevering. So, <laughs> Yeah, baby, you really going, somebody Somebody is really going some places, because whoever you are, I'm just seeing, like, the sky is the limit with you, and the endless possibilities that are coming your way. I use my vibration oracle deck. I've been doing a lot of oracles, okay? I have not pulled any tarot, and none of these readings, so I just got it to do some oracle sign readings, right? It's something about raising your vibration. It's something about keeping the vibration level up here. Okay, I can't make this shit up. See this from a higher perspective. So you're seeing something from a higher perspective here. Facing my shadow removes darkness from the world. Okay, you understanding that, you know, you've been, you can, you can either stay in your shadow side or you can, you know, evolve. Yeah, like a butterfly. Okay, relationships are assignments. Yes, whoever you are, you are understanding there is some type of relationship that is like your assignment here. It's like something that's in, that's ordained and you can feel it, right? You can feel it because you have confidence in this relationship. Yeah, your, sens your sensitivity is a gift. So you're being, your senses, <laughs> I'm wearing spider senses. So you could feel like, like things are tingling. Something is like really giving you a lot of energy. So you can have a lot of energy, whoever you are. Okay, this has something to do with your perspective when it comes to some type of relationship. Because you are like, damn, whoever this is, you 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 met them and was like, damn, this is my assignment. Okay, like, ooh, wait, confirmation. Yeah, feeling fur is a call of love. You love somebody. You love somebody and you facing my shadow removes darkness from the world. And this person helped you, you know, see the light in your own life, right? Wow. Yeah, devotion unites me with the infinity. So you are understanding that, you know, why am I hearing buzz like your infinity and beyond, right? Somebody loves you infinity and beyond, baby. <laughs> Somebody is like, like I said, whoever you are, you could be a masculine or I could be talking to a masculine, but you are like somebody's superhero, okay? You really are, right? Oh, I trust in my gifts. And somebody is helping you to trust in your own gifts, 434, because they see you are a leader here. And it's okay to feel what you need to feel. Manifesting is my superpower. You are a divine of the universe, okay? You are supported on your path. Your mind is an altar source of energy. So, yeah, you are realizing that you have attracted somebody that is of your highest good. Not even knowing that your higher self was communicating with you. 
you attracted somebody that was like in your energy field so like yeah spirit said this is it's definitely what you manifested sir or ma'am like you could be like trying to deny it like no it's it's unbelievable that's what i just heard it's unbelievable but that's the point of having endless possibilities so you can believe even if the relationship didn't work out i feel like you are okay because you understand that's your assignment you know that was your assignment your assignment was to grow and evolve right give me more for my collective i can't fucking make this up Somebody could be celebrating. I don't know why when I seen celebration, I heard, I heard it's our anniversary transformation. So you can, you could be celebrating an anniversary right now with somebody, or you know you could be you know planning to marry somebody. But whatever you are doing, you are manifesting, right? And this is strong powers five by five at this time. Be very honest and clear about what you wish to manifest in your life. Write it down on the paper. Manifestation step one. So yeah, whoever you are, baby. You are manifesting because yeah you in love okay you went you walked through the shadows and you like i'm hearing stand up you are standing up somebody's like i'm ready to be the man that, that, that they need to be for somebody okay let me see let me i think i may want to pull some terror some terror okay let me put some terror for my herb signs yeah, my earth signs, y'all are real grounded. Your energy is real grounded at this time. So continue to stay grounded because you're manifesting her. Okay. Give me one card for my earth signs. One card. So we have a uh, queen of wands, and she did come out in reverse. So there is something about self-respect her being an introvert. Okay, so... Somebody's very insecure, right? You have some type of woman here that's very insecure. Like I said, even if this was a relationship that, that didn't serve your highest good, you're understanding your assignment. You're using your intuition. But this Queen of Wands is, is, is not trying to see something from a higher perspective, right? This woman doesn't want to let you go, okay? This could be a fire sign woman, okay? She can have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius in her chart. Why is this Queen of Wands in reverse for her? seven of wands okay this woman to be going through some challenges and you could like block this woman out because this woman is like she's being so bitter like you have to literally protect your energy right this is too many cords okay clarify seven of wands yeah you're protecting your energy you're protecting something here i can't make this shit up the moon in reverse you're releasing fur and you're releasing emotions here when it comes to the darkness, okay? Because you met someone new and this woman is mad because you met someone new and you're moving on, okay? She can't cause you any type of confusions. We have water sign, Pisces, okay? Leo, every Sagittarius, fire sign, heavy. I can't make this shit up. This woman's under judgment because you met your match, baby. Okay, I'm hearing that. I just want to say, you're mine, you're mine. Somebody wants you to know, fuck what you heard. You're mine, you're mine. This empress came through. And like I said, Buzz Lightyear energy, her, okay, infinity and beyond. And you feeling this energy with this empress, like this empress is making you feel like, hold on, it's judgment because I do not feel protected with this queen of wands. Somebody's like, I do not feel, I just feel like I had to learn a lesson. And somebody wants to learn a lesson and step into some energy, divine energy. I'm telling you, the sun card, the towel, and it's causing towels because you are abundant. Someone knows that you are manifesting with someone. And somebody knows that you found you found somebody on your level. So this person knows this because you're blocking them, right? I can't make this up. Eight of Pentacles. Earth energy. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay, somebody knows you're a hard worker and you have a lot of talents. Page of Swords, this person is constantly watching you and this other person, and constantly watching this other person, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and it's stressed out. Nine of Swords. Ooh, wee, what the fuck? Y'all just got all type of people in y'all energy. Y'all, it's, it's, it's past lovers. Like, somebody feels defeated, okay? 
somebody is constantly trying to stir apart her creating some type of tension within you trying to do the most but okay you you thought about it and you understood that you want justice when it comes to this situation because you got your empress okay it's like you found heaven on earth right and this is your justice whoever you are because you made a decision here for a cups to leave somebody in their own energy right Okay, somebody's very emotional. Okay, they 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 wanted you to feel stagnant and burdened her and overwhelmed her. Somebody just like, but you almost thirst. So it's like you almost thirst. So put those tears. Okay, put those tears. Cry those tears, baby. Okay, and put put everything. Put your best foot forward. Okay, Ace of Cups. I can't make this up because you have a new beginning. Ten twenty eight. As I say that, Ace of Cups with the Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, you feel like you lost out on something, baby. But it's so much more to come in for you. What's coming in? It's so much more coming in for you, baby. I can't make this up. Queen of Swords and the Ten of Cups. It's just you learning and evolving, right? Okay, you you telling you're you're speaking you some type of judgment her, but you're taking total authority over your emotions her. This is somebody who is emotionally mature her that's coming in, and it's going to bring you complete happiness, right? And you're going to be very happy. It's going to cause a terrible moment because you're going to be very abundant with somebody and manifesting. But when you get out the energy of juggling masks on whoever you are and you stand up, this person ain't going to be able to touch this. <laughs> I'm hearing, can't touch, I can't make this up. Soon I try to pull this deck out. This court came right out. Decision. So, yeah, you making a decision, baby. Somebody can't touch this. You you juggling up. You're raising your vibration masculine. Like I said, you could just be not fucking with these hoes, okay? <laughs> not fucking with these bitches. Like, girl, I don't want you all on me. Okay? You're very, yeah, sustain. Sus you are sustaining. You are releasing, okay? You are releasing these evil assassins, right? These Jezebels. Yeah. You could be very, like, cultivated. Very cultured. Like, people learn a lot from you. Yeah, and you're focused on your priorities. Somebody is trying to grow. You are reflecting on something here. You're growing up. Mm -hmm. You're growing up, masculine. Okay, I just feel like I'm talking to a masculine, a real man. Real man. Okay. You don't even got to be a man, but you can have a lot of masculine energy. Let me get one for my soul's growth deck. If I can find it, y'all. have where am i with my health goals where do i want to be why am i not there what will it take for me to feel well if my body could talk it would say blank feed your body what it needs to feel nourished hold on though like y'all somebody's doing heavy fucking throat magic on me because my words been all fucked up today but i ain't stopped okay <laughs> needs to feel more nurtured okay appreciated and love make some new exciting goals to take your health to the next level so yeah divine masculine you could be just you know it's weird to be guiding you to focus on your health right now okay leave me leave all this stuff in the past okay this is like you be protecting yourself from all these different energies in your body because you know you are what you feed your body your mind and your soul baby where can I create more space? Instead of fulfilling, filling yourself up with the busy work and things to do, create more sacred space in your schedule, in your home, your mind, your lungs, and in your heart. Take time to just be. Do a declutter detox uh, from your schedule, home, and most self. Make space, clarity, and, and clarity will come. So, yeah, make space for yourself. Take time for yourself. Now, you know, you could be, like, going through something, and you're trying to focus, so you're trying to just work, work, work. But take care of your body because, like, if you can't take care of yourself, then how are you going to go get that money? Right, but you have to really take time, okay? Even if you don't meditate, like, just, you know, just give yourself a little time to think sometimes. You don't have to do everything at once. Whoever you are, you probably like, hey, I'm going to get this. I can't do this. I got to go get it, okay? Take time, baby. Take it slow. Ooh, somebody wants you to take it slow with them too, baby. Okay, that's all I got for you, Earth Signs. Love and light. Namaste. I'll shave.